you're starting to get a little glimpse of how the way you train takes on how things are. If you overexcite yourself past normal, it doesn't feel right. If you go below, it doesn't feel right. In the middle, it's just perfect. You're calm, you can see everything for what it is. Until you can just relax and step on the person, like you, yourself, it's hard to picture hitting somebody. You see the problem you have? If you walk up like this to the person, and you know, you're all broken up, it'll be very hard for you to develop strikes. You're too worried about the person for yourself. You gotta just be cool about it, just that. Weight start. Right away the muscles start to contract. The ner I can feel the nerve now down the femoral artery. And for me, all my breathing effort is to relax this. Because I know any more from this will be worse for me. So I know this sucks, any more will suck more. So it's like I take my, 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 my odds, I say, okay, I'll stay with the sucks, not the sucks more. So as he steps, I kind of relax myself, and that's it. And I let the pain come to my head, but not to my nerves. Sounds kind of funny, guys, but you can override this. You can control them, okay? Not bad. But when you just kind of not think about the person, just kind of... You didn't really worry about them at all. All of a sudden, it's this nice, you know, relaxation. You know, you can, you know, sit and lie down and turn over. Really, you know, sorry, I gotta, I gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. That's it, You've, you're really relaxed inside. You can do it all day, have a, you know, really uh, dance on the person and not feel bad about it. You see they're okay, and you can really relax with each other. So I'm just trying to relax my arm and drop it. The pain starts to go through your partner. You can try to relax. Give uh, your partner a chance to kind of feel okay with the contact and not to let it to go to your head. Guys, watch me again. Remember what I told you about base knowledge? Base knowledge should never go past normal. So I'm going to walk around Mark in a normal way, what I deem normal. My own normal. In the same fashion and strike. Slowly, around him, normally. And if I can't do this without feeling bad or without feeling uh, upset about it, I already have a problem. There's no point in attacking or doing something at this point. You need to feel comfortable touching the person. And the person needs to feel okay with taking this stuff on him. Otherwise, he's just full of nerves, right? Again, we're talking about building a warrior spirit, a warrior's mentality. He doesn't worry about these little hits. He's, he's already it's to strengthen him so that he's not freaking out upon contact, okay? Hold your fist in such a way, comfortable distance from the, from the person, okay? Don't launch it from here, go fast, and then come close and touch. Pick up the fist from a distance that you feel comfortable and hit. That's it. Comfortable distance, hit. Pick up your fist, leave it at the distance that you feel comfortable and punch. Don't do this cocking back stuff. Just li leave it at the distance you feel comfortable and let it fall. And then everything from here on in is your mental, that you feel okay with touching the person. And that they're okay. You see, look at Mark, the spot that I hit, there's nothing there. There's, there's no residual, there's nothing. That's it. And he's really working on the mental side. So, nah, it's okay. For me, I'm trying to stay as normal as I can. I should be able to hit, and then be able to talk to somebody else and have a normal conversation and then go back to this, that's it.